Hey, fabulous author. I heard something really cool this week that I wanted to share with you. Now, I was watching a video in relation to making videos and why we get so nervous when we're on camera, but this really applies to every area of your author branding. Now, what was being said was that we get nervous because we're focused on ourselves, on how we look, on how we sound, on how our hair is, on how we act. But the second we take the focus off of us and put it onto the value and benefits we're giving to our fans, that's the second that we stop being nervous. And I know this to be true because this is what I do myself. I oftentimes get nervous being on camera when I look and I see my hair's all weird, or I sound a little strange, or I mess up my lines, and I'm focused on me, I get really nervous. But the second I stop thinking about me and I start thinking about what I can do for you to help you, that's the second that I stop being nervous and I just launch into what I'm doing and create something amazing for you. And this is applicable to you too. Whether you are creating a video, you're writing a blog post, you're doing an interview, you're working on your newsletter, all of that needs to be dedicated to your fans and to giving them benefit and value in what you're creating. And the second you start looking at them and not yourself, you stop being nervous about what you're doing and you just do it. Amazing, right? Now here's the thing. I tell my photography clients all the time that they need to exist in photos for their family. Because oftentimes, a parent will be behind the camera and never in front of the camera because they're a little bit worried about how they look and how they're dressed and how they're appearing on camera and they're never in any pictures. But your fans are like children. They just want you. They don't care how you look. They don't care how you sound. They don't care how you act. They just want you. And you need to give them you. And you can do that by not focusing on yourself and just focus on what benefits and what value you can give to them. What can you do for them? When you do what you can do for them, not for you, you stop being nervous and you get it done and you give them something amazing and they appreciate that more than you know. So you don't have to be nervous when you are on Snapchat or when you're on Instagram stories or when you're on Facebook Live or when you're recording a video or when you're doing an interview because it's not about you, it's about them. And the second you make it about them, it's no longer about you and you have no reason to be nervous. I promise you can do this. You can do this and be fabulous and be amazing. You have it in you. I know it's nervous, it's nerve wracking, and it's going to be a little bit worrisome for you, but I promise if I can do it, you can do it. I am not someone who likes to hang out on camera all the time, but I do it for you because it's valuable to you and it helps you. And when I'm not focused on me, it's not a problem. So yeah, sometimes my hair is messed up and sometimes I mess up my lines and sometimes I don't sound good and I don't like my voice and I don't like what I'm wearing and I look a little tired and I'm not super enthusiastic, but I do it anyway and it helps you. And I'm okay with that. I don't have to be perfect. I just have to exist in these videos, in these photos, in these interviews, in the resources that I'm putting out there and you have to exist too. You don't have to be perfect. You're not perfect. You're never going to be perfect. You just have to exist, and they will appreciate that more than you have any idea. I'm Cam Robinson of Cam Robinson Photography and Reading Transforms. Stay inspired.